New misconduct claims against an L.A. area state senator tonight. And new rules on how to handle sexual assault allegations in the California Senate. KCAL 9's Christy Fajardo has been following all the late breaking developments and she joins us live from the newsroom with more. Christy. Yeah, this is really shaking up Sacramento. There's already fallout from the latest scandal. Late tonight, the Senate Rules Committee said when it comes to sexual harassment and misconduct, the state Senate will no longer police itself. Senator Mendoza, can we talk to you? We saw State Senator Tony Mendoza on the other side of this door. He wouldn't talk. The legislator from Artesia is once again accused of acting inappropriately with a young woman, this time a former intern in 2008. Jennifer Court tells the Sacramento Bee she was 19 when Mendoza got her to a convention alone, plied her with alcohol, and made her so uncomfortable she invented a ruse to fly home. Late Sunday night, we got this email from his office reading, the allegation is completely false, but some of his constituents aren't buying it. I think he should step down. I think he should immediately step down. The Senate Rules Committee isn't going that far, but in a statement late Sunday night wrote, in part, today in light of troubling allegations in the media against a sitting senator, effective immediately, Senate rules will no longer be handling complaints of sexual abuse or assault. Instead, an independent outside legal team will investigate any and all allegations and make findings and recommendations to resolve and where appropriate discipline. The move comes after the committee itself was accused of retaliating against whistleblowers. A lawyer for a former Mendoza staffer says her client and two others were fired after they complained to the Senate Rules Committee that Mendoza was acting inappropriately towards a 23-year-old fellow. The Senate Rules Committee denies the allegations. So has Mendoza, who says he apologizes if he ever miscommunicated or made an employee feel uncomfortable. Tonight, Senator Mendoza was silent on social media, but some of his colleagues weren't, including a local assemblywoman and a regional director for the California Democratic Party, who are calling on him to step down. Back to you.